under the leadership and direction of His Highness the Aga Khan, the Imam or spiritual leader of the Shia Ismaili Muslim community. Ismaili centers have been established in countries around the world where Ismailis reside. The Ismaili Center Houston will join centers in London, Vancouver, Lisbon, Dubai, Dushanbe, and Toronto. Rooted in the rich tapestry of Muslim heritage, the architecture of the Ismaili centers draws inspiration from historic decorative traditions. Each center is architecturally distinct, fusing local architectural styles with traditional design elements. Through their design and functions, the Ismaili centers reflect a mood of humility, friendship, and dialogue with a forward outlook, providing spaces for broadening intellectual horizons and fostering an appreciation of pluralism as well as for congregational prayer and spiritual search. One of the ways in which the Ismailis have expressed their identity wherever they have lived is through their places of prayer, known today as the Jamaat Khana. Other Muslim communities give their religious buildings different names, from Ribat and Zawiya to Khanaka. And in addition, there are other places where Muslims of all interpretations can come together such as the non-denominational mosques. What we dedicate today is what we identify as an Ismaili center, a building that is focused around our Jamaat Khana, which also includes many secular spaces. These are places where Ismailis and non-Ismailis, Muslims and non-Muslims, will gather for shared activities, seminars and lectures, recitals and receptions, exhibitions and social events. These meeting halls and lounges, work offices and conference rooms will serve the organizational needs of the Ismaili community. But they will also, we trust, be filled with the sounds of enrichment, dialogue and warm human rapport as Ismailis and non-Ismailis share their lives in a healthy, gregarious spirit.
The center will be a place of peace, humility, reflection, and prayer. It will be a place of search and enlightenment, not of anger or of obscurantism. It will be a center which will seek to bond men and women in this pluralist country, to replace their fragility in their narrow spheres by the strength of civilized society bound together by a common destiny. It is already a symbol of the hopes of people who live through change and turbulence and have ultimately found security and opportunity here in the United States, and the majority of whom have chosen the state of Texas. <laughs>